sports. According to an update from the National Sports Commission, the second leg of this year's inter Guyana's Games has been cancelled. The first leg was cancelled earlier in the year. More details from Sasha Ramsara. According to a press release from the National Sports Commission dated October 1, 2015, at the inter Guyana Games meeting convened on August 13 to 14 in Suriname, all three countries agreed that the first leg was cancelled because of miscommunication. It was stated that French Guyana was facing some serious challenges with various sports associations as it related to the organizing of the second leg, which also included budgetary changes. French Guyana promised to inform the other two countries on a final position with respect to its organizing the second leg for October 27th to 31st by August 31st. Both Suriname and Guyana agreed to participate if French Guyana was able to host. On August 31st, however, French Guyana indicated that due to the hosting of its general elections in December, it would not be able to host the event. French Guyana then proposed that Guyana organizes a second leg, with a budget supported by French Guyana and Guyana for chess and badminton only. However, Guyana immediately informed both French Guyana and Suriname that unfortunately it would not be able to host as their venues are presently under renovation. However, Gan indicated that if Suriname was willing to host a second leg on its own, or with the support from French Guyana, Guyana will participate. On September 16, Suriname stated that because of some challenges, it would not be possible to take on the responsibility. As a consequence, the second leg of the Inter-Guyana Games 2015 will not be staged. French Guyana, Suriname and Guyana have given their commitment to ensure the continuation of the Inter-Guyana Games as the Games have much interest among the youths of the three countries. The three countries have also unanimously accepted that it is necessary that an early meeting after elections in French Guyana be organized to commence discussions and preparations for the Inter-Guyana Games 2016. Sasha Ramsaran reporting for Channel 8 News.